Okay, hello everybody and welcome back to Mass Effect 3 where we're gonna go welcome to the Citadel Shepard. Embassies and go talk to the guy whose name starts with a J and who is a an STG, an inspector. We're gonna do that little mission which involves Kasumi. I wonder if I'll be able to pick out which mission is supposed to be, uh... Zaid, that's his name. I... That, I'm not sure why. There was something important I had to do. Oh, are you looking for someone, ma'am? I... Maybe. I have these papers, but I'm not sure why. Here, why don't I take care of these for you? Would that help? Yes. Yes, please. You know, you remind me of someone. My son. He's dating an Asari. She looks remarkably like you do. He's so very happy. Thank you. That's wonderful, ma'am. It's heartbreaking! Ah! Oh yeah, I gotta talk to Commander Bailey too. Hold on, let me talk to Bailey really quick. Shepard, to what do I owe the pleasure? I'm here to talk to you about releasing Jonas Adaris. Damn, you too? Somebody got the council to order her release. I'm delaying as best I can. What's your stake in this? It's classified. That's a fancy way of saying mind your own business. Look, there's no way I'm letting that psychopath out. The woman's unstable and a clear public threat. What makes you think she's crazy? She was a ruthless sadist before she got caught. Her imprisonment has cracked a shell off the nut. Maybe freedom will improve her. Ha <laughs> ha! She rages day and night, Shepard, calling for the deaths of all Eclipse enemies. No, freedom will only give her the chance to kill. I'd like access to her to judge for myself. Sure thing. I'm sure you'll agree. Then maybe the Council will listen to you and rescind the order. Go to the C-Sec outpost. My assistant will connect to Sedera's cell from there. Then call me back. All right, Bailey. I'll do you proud, buddy. Don't worry about it. Yondam. Commander Shepard. Jondam Val. Special Yondam. tactics and recon. I've got intel suggesting that high-level Hanar officials may be indoctrinated. Hanar, of course. That's a damning accusation. What have you got? Evidence of an Alliance Black Ops team raiding a Batarian research station. The Batarians were studying Reaper technology. The Batarians had Reaper technology? The Alliance raid turned into a massacre, and the humans ended up with nothing. Your people faked a power failure to hide the incident. The Batarians would have gone to war if they'd found out. But how does this implicate the Hanar? They maintained discreet gray market trade relationships with the Batarians, and led the Alliance to the station. Oh, boy! We suspect those Hanar operatives escaped with Batarian tech. If your reports on the Reapers are accurate, they could already be indoctrinated. What's your source on all this? It was an anonymous gift, but I believe it came from a thief named Kasumi Goto. I've been after her for years. Hey! Kasumi? You're hunting a thief? A master thief. Her intelligence and skill are almost salarian. <laughs> I'm sure she'd appreciate praise from the specter who's chasing her down. I only need her data. I admire her personally. And since she sent me this, I assume her feelings are mutual. <laughs> I love it! What do you need me to do? The Hanar operative is now a diplomat on the Citadel. I don't have a public name, and the Hanar will go to ground if I make a formal inquiry. So we're hunting? Ah, <laughs> Shepard. I'm tracking okay. suspicious transmissions to the Hanar homeworld. I could use your help. Let me see what I can dig up at the Spectre office. Thanks, Shepard. And for the record, not everyone doubted your concerns about the Reapers. I just hope we're not too late. I think many Spectres would have been... on board, you know? So, yeah! remember when you helped me get KG's gray box from Donovan Hawk? The one with information that could start a war. I thought we destroyed that information to keep you safe. There were enough clues left for me to piece things together when I... got curious. It was big enough to leak it to Bao. If you don't mind me tagging along cloaked, maybe I can help you dig up some dirt on the Hanar. <laughs> I'd appreciate it. And we're not like, hey, how's it going? It's been a while. Where are you at? Where are you at, Kazumi? Ah, yeah, yeah. 
Okay. Spectre level access code can bypass privacy settings. Whew. Yep. An instructor that gives them academy have a course of facilities and citadel training young students who escaped the attack in the school or are not ready to join the older students in combat. Citadel authorities will find room for the students if a specter approves their quest. Why, why a specter? Like, um, yes, let them in. Shepard, I'm checking security reports. Can you track the transfers coming from the Hanar embassy? On it. Bao's got a good plan. Hanar are predictable. Anything suspicious in their terminal use should narrow down our list of suspects. So you approve of Bao? Absolutely. He's a good specter. The galaxy needs more like him. And the fact that he's trying to arrest you? <laughs> well, nobody's perfect. <laughs> oh, I'd like to get the widow. Would I ever like to get the widow? Uh, sure. We'll get the shotgun ones too. All right, well, let's see if I can... Play in the shooting range. I don't think I've ever actually been in here, to be honest. Hopefully it works. I sort of feel like the game crashed last time I tried to come in here, and so I was gonna save before I came in. And I feel like the game has crashed now, and saving would have been a good idea. Huh. Looks like the game's crashed. Okay, I only had to go back a little ways. Uh, I had to restart the computer, or the Xbox. Cause yep, I kind of remembered that that area was, uh, there was a reason I never really go in there. And it was because the first time I tried to go in there, the game crashed, so that's nice. So I can't go test out weapons, but that's all right. Um, let's see, where does it say? Hanar Diplomat. Find evidence on the Hanar and the Presidium Embassy. All right. I think we can go to that station over there. Yup. Bell, I have some possible hits. Got some strange money transfers on Balone, and Olun is sending a lot of data. Balone's clean. His money transfers are to support his mistress. Not sure about Olun. I'll pull his bio. I'll check Olun's personal records and pull his recent messages. Can I just note how odd it is for a Hanar to have a mistress? Yep. You know, if Bao catches up with you, I can grant you immunity. What? If I join up? Last time I did that, you wrote me into a suicide mission. No! I didn't say you had to join up. You were working your way around to it. No, I wasn't. And you joined up because you had something you needed help with and it was Cerberus. I didn't rope you into anything. Oh, let's check the map. <laughs> Why do you hurt me so? It's on the docks. All right. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Uh, it's tempting to bring Kasumi along. Will she comment on other things if you do other things with her around? Like if I brought her to go talk to the Blue Suns guy? Might mess it up though. I'll, maybe I'll save and try and see if anything happens. Now arriving in oh wait, the e terminal's right here though. Bao, well, Olun's doing some heavy lobbying for the Hanar to support the war effort. So he's clearly not indoctrinated. Who's opposing him? An unnamed Hanar recently... Ah. Oh, that happened last time, I think. It all comes down to the war. And you trying to pull everyone into... Th uh, this is unfair accusations! Did you win? No. 
and I owe you for getting you don't owe me because you helped me on the sur the suicide mission the Reapers aren't people I can't infiltrate a Reaper party and steal a big I win bomb that's not what I'm trying to do I wasn't gonna ask you for that let's see I think Pretty sure at some point that uh, Cortez comes down here. Let me see. He might be. He might not be here at all, but. He is on the viewing deck. Alright, I just didn't see him there. We'll have to make sure to go hang out with him. Beautiful city. You should visit. I was on my boat when, boom, the sky went black, dust and ash. A giant metal wall rushed down. I fell into the river. Do you humans ever stop talking? No. Nope. When I climbed out, I heard screaming. The metal wall started to move and I realized it was a leg. Only one of the Reaper's legs. Yep. wasn't kidding. The great Commander Shepard on a leash. I'm here for my own reasons, Vosk. Oh, sure you are. Anyway, tell her I'm impressed, but to do business, I still need my little problem taken care of. Which is? A Torian general named Oraka has it out for the Blue Suns. He's raising a stink over our activity in this sector. I'll commit my gang to Arya as soon as Oraka's dead. There must be more to Oraka's complaint. We're just making little raids along trading routes. With Arya's blessing, I might add. Oraka's just some military fossil who came out of retirement to relive the glory days and justify his existence. Losing him won't affect your war in the least, but gaining the Blue Suns, well, you know our work. You seriously think I'll assassinate a Turian general? Arya seems to think so. Or else... Why would she send you? She knew the price. The two of you work it out. Oh, and, uh... <laughs> tell Arya I still expect her blue ass in bed with me. Yeah, good luck with that, man. That is not happening in a million what is years. It, Shepard? You knew about this? Can you be more specific? <laughs> Darner Vosk expects me to kill General Oraka. Operations. I figured you'd talk to a rock and see if you can get him to lay off. And if he won't listen to reason, call me and I'll take care of it. I don't see the distinction. The distinction is that I'm giving you the chance to save his life. Right. Why didn't you just tell me this yourself? Vosk needed to see you, needed to realize who he's dealing with. Plus, if I have to suffer that scumbag staring at my tits one more time, <laughs> I have to kill him. <laughs> Yeah, he mentioned that, uh... <laughs> going to sleep with him? We all have our delusions. Yep. What about the food we were promised? It's been allocated to the Presidium. Then contact Commander Bailey over at CSEC. Tell him Garrus Vicarian would consider it a personal favor if he could reallocate the shipment so these people don't starve. Yeah, poor Bailey. Bailey probably didn't have a hand in that. <laughs> oh wait, uh, terminal. There's another terminal over here. I believe. Yeah. I've got a list of new Hanar arrivals, Bao. Forwarding it to you. Damn. These are all face names. The Hanar names from the Alliance raid are soul names. And Hanar soul names are private. There's no public record. Can you get back to their personal communications? On it. Maybe we'll find names there. So how's the rest of the gang? Met up with anybody else? Garrus is helping out on the Normandy. He never could pass up a good fight. What about Jacob? I'm just talking to myself. Haven't heard from him. See, 
Jacob could have gotten me back onto the Normandy. <laughs> I'm touched. <laughs> I'm not good enough for you, Kasumi. Val, well, here's the correspondence. I've got it. A recent arrival. Zemendis. Sole name regards the works of the Enkindlers in despair. He was with the Alliance team that massacred the Batarians. He's been on special research assignment ever since. Yeah. So, he got his tentacles on some Reaper tech. Looks that way. I'm sending you the nav point for his office. I'll meet you there. You coming, Kazumi? Uh, where are we going? Garrus, Jonas Sedaris, General Raka. Bane! Oh, yeah. Alright. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Where are we at? Please select uh, Citadel Embassies. One moment. We get to go into an area we can't go into usually in this section. Kind of makes me mad you can't go in there all the time, but they have to draw the line somewhere, I guess. It would just be a giant empty space, really. But there's a lot of that. My ship. Jiggle, jiggle, jiggle. Zamandis? Or should I say, regards the works of the Enkindlers in despair? It seems this one has been apprehended, but confinement is irrelevant. The work of the Enkindlers cannot be stopped. Why are you trying to help the Reapers? We obtained information regarding the Enkindlers from classified sources. The Enkindlers? You mean the Protheans? Yes. As you are aware, Commander Shepard, the Protheans eventually became the Collectors, and the Collectors served the Reapers. Well, you've got to be kidding me. <laughs> Therefore, as a faithful servant of the Enkindlers, we too must serve the Reapers. You big, stupid jellyfish. <laughs> you know, I support religious freedom for all species, but that's just crazy. That's just crazy. Your skepticism does not matter. When the Enkindlers uplift us as their chosen sapiens, the galaxy will bear witness. Yeah, huh? You're insane, and we can't allow you to endanger your planet. We are taking you into custody. Your belief in your victory is mistaken. Our planetary defense network is largely automated. It can be disabled with a single virus. Which I have just uploaded. So... Damn it. Wait, a virus would be detected unless sent on low-priority channels, which have a time lag. I may be able to block the upload. But, but, you may be delayed. I really doubt. Help him. I'll handle this. Shepard's like, I got this. <laughs> we just killed a Hanar. Oh, what color blood do Hanar have? Looks like we're in the... Wait. He's got some kind of failsafe. Get down. Kazumi! No! She was here the entire time. Yeah. She was an old friend. I intended to arrest her. Yep. She helped me take down the collectors, and she just gave her life to save the Hanar homeworld. Point taken. It was an honor to work with you, Shepard. When the time comes, I'll be there to return the favor with a few friends. Kazumi, wake up now. You can come out now. <laughs> How'd you know? Lucky guess. There's no way you're recruiting me to fight in a galactic war. The Crucible Project needs technical experts. I'm not a scientist. <laughs> no, but you're the best thief in the galaxy. And you can hack unfamiliar technology better than anyone. They could use your help. And think of it. All that expensive tech just lying around. Oh, man! It's not like they're going to check your pockets at the end of the project. You say the nicest thing. <laughs> All right. I'm in. And Shep. Nice working with you again. You too, Kasumi. I wish you could come with me. You really get a very limited selection of uh, companions in Mass Effect 3. You don't get a Solarian or a Krogan. You know? 
Dang, now we got the Hanar Andrel forces. Uh, but yeah, no, I don't know. I don't know. Commander Shepard, please select a destination. Areas tagged of interest to you are highlighted on the elevator menu. I really don't know why he would have uploaded the virus to take out his own home planet when if he said that they were going to be elevated, you know what I mean? For assistance. Where did we want to go? We want to go to the Presidium. Areas tagged of interest to you are highlighted on the elevator menu. Right? Well, to do the blue sounds thing, we actually, I don't think we have a relic yet that we could use. What else was it? Oh yeah, we gotta go, we gotta go talk to, Welcome we can get the Commander eclipse Shepard. done now. Please select a destination. In the Presidium Commons. One moment. Well, we just got a big chunk of forces from doing that little mission. Hanar and Drell forces. The Drell will be extremely useful. I wish we could see more Drell and stuff walking around. I wish we could see more variety in the Hanar and the Elcor and the Drell. And I don't know. Now so many things you could wish for and you want, but you just, it's just not going to happen. I guess it doesn't matter how I do it. I just need to tell him about us. Wait. Us? Uh -huh. You and me. He doesn't need to know that. Wouldn't it be better for him to just know that you'd grown apart? I thought I was supposed to be honest with him. You are. But you're just being tactful. Not rubbing it in. Uh-huh. Yeah. Oh my gosh, my phone will not shut up today. Holy crap. I'm just gonna put it on freaking airplane mode. I'm done. Stop talking to me. Yo, Rock, I'm gonna try and save your life. Commander Shepard. General Araka. Yep. I think we met in Korra's den. I thought he was that one. If I recall. Yes. Next deep in drink just before I retired. I'm clean now. Reinstated. I hear you're taking on the Blue Suns. I need to do my part for the Citadel, Commander. The Blue Suns are raiding CSEC weapons shipments. I'm putting a stop to that. Those mercs are seriously jeopardizing the Citadel's ability to defend itself if the war comes here. When the war comes here. There are other ways to secure weapons, General. You don't think I've tried? There's a black market dealer on Citadel right now, but he won't sell his top-line arms. The Reapers are destroying everything in their path, and I can't stop them. But I can stop the Blue Suns. Let me see what I can do for you. I'd appreciate your help, and I'll have a plan of action ready if things fall through. Oh, buddy, it's gonna be okay, buddy. Oh, I'll help you out, man. This is not a who, buddy. That one was quite stressful. I was like, oh the my gosh. Is supposed to send in more residents to help with all the new refugees. Yeah, they've been promising a. Well, we're luckier than most other hospitals. At least our budget cuts are minimal. Shit, don't remind me. My old job had the emergency ward night staff cut to half before I left. Oh, let me guess. You don't process as many patients as the day shift. I've got the numbers to prove it. Typical administrator who has no clue what's going on in the ward. Yikes. All right, bro, help me out. I've connected with Jonas Sedaris and her cell, Commander. You can speak with her via that console. Thanks. We'll need some privacy. Of course. When you're done, you can also contact Commander Bailey from that terminal. Who's that spying on me now? Ah, uh, I see. Good. Arya's 
indentured servant has finally come to deliver. This just makes me feel grungy. I want to talk with you before I secure your release. Bullshit. You have no choice. And when I get out, heads will roll. <laughs> oh, yes. You've killed a lot of my people. Don't think I've forgotten that. Hmm. You have to move on. And I will, once all my enemies are dead. I love holding all the cards. Even in here, you must deal with me. I have all the power. Is that right? <laughs> yes, saying my second in command is a weak-willed toady. If he had balls, he'd leave me to rot and take control himself. But he won't defy me. He knows better. Now get me out of here, Shepard. Tell Bailey to release me. Bailey, I've seen Sedaris. Yeah. So she's crazy, right? It would be ridiculous to let her out. She's a menace. <laughs> yep. Let me try to make this problem go away. Sounds good. I'll hold the line until I hear from you. It's all right. It's good. We're going to go talk to the guy. It's going to be all right. It's going to be all right. And he's a Solarian, too. Very tell the other the guy we're going to talk to later. Look, Commander, I don't want any trouble. I'm authorized to sell here, and all my arms are legal. See? See? These are lightweight weapons. Where's your top-end inventory? Shit. You slumming for C-Sec, too? I already got harassed by the old Turian with a bad attitude. Yeah, I got much better stuff, but it's off the market. Galaxy's going belly up. Credit won't mean anything once the Reapers rip through. So what exactly are you saying? Whatever happens, I figure there'll be survivors, and it'll be chaos. I'm betting things will run on a barter system. So I'm getting a jump. My best stock only trades for hard goods and artifacts with real value. Mm. So what gets me access to your top shelf? Heh, <laughs> Turian just waved credits in my face and then spat on it. Nice to see you have flexibility. If you find any rare pieces when you're out saving the galaxy, bring them back. Then I'm happy to share my top stock with C-Sec, no problem. Outside of that, I gotta stick to my guns. Okie dokie. Credits don't talk with me, Commander. C-Sec wants my top of the line. You gotta come through with all right, I haven't found any artifacts yet, but I'll start scanning systems. I really need to do that. I need to start scanning systems because there's only... You need to scan as many as you can for resources, and then when you've, uh... When you've gone out, when you've, like, worn out your welcome in certain systems, you have to do a main mission to reset it. Commander. Unless you can find a new source of weapons for C-Sec, I'm putting together a task force to stop the Blue Suns myself. I'll get you your weapons, General. I appreciate the effort, but I've spent too much time out of action, Commander. Won't be able to sit on my hands much longer. It's okay, dude, I got you. Oh, buddy, don't even worry about it, man. All right, now we gotta go to the docks. And right? No. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please select a destination. No, where am I? I need to go talk. No, yeah, you need to go to the docks. One moment, yep, yep. Please. This guy is sitting like right next to Garrus. Oh my Garrus, why are you letting these people in? Well, you know. You gotta let people in. Sometimes. There's a bad cookie amidst the bunch, but you can't just la leave innocent people to suffer. You know? Garrus is mostly in charge of the Turians being in the Citadel, too, but... Emergency civilian housing. Oh, and then we gotta go check on Cortez. Can I ask, where were you when the Reapers... Did you shut up? I'm sorry? I don't want to hear it. You humans think you had it rough? You know what happened on Karshan? My apologies. I thought since your home will. Stop! Just stop! Yeah. Not good. Karshan. Karshan definitely took the brunt of it and got run over. Men, get ready for trouble. Yeah, well, you know, Garrus is gonna. Pop Not here for butts. that thing. Just want to talk about Jonas Sedaris's release. Yeah, you try to oh, take on Shepard and Garrus Vicarian? Right? My idea, you know. Arya came to me looking to gain Eclipse support. I'm leveraging it to bust the boss out. 
saying you should run Eclipse. Huh? <laughs> you can do it. Leave Sedaris locked up and make the deal with Arya yourself. Hmm. Arya would be a step up. And you think she'd let me run things? I don't see why not. Right. Right. Then that's the plan. Keep Sedaris in jail. I'll call Arya right away. Good man. Interesting that it work out so well, though, for real sees It's like, oh, man. I mean, really, what do the other people think? Maybe they just don't care, really, you know? They're like, as long as I get paid, they're mercenaries, you know? Still. I feel like Satan is, like, perfect, too. Shepard, the council withdrew the release order for Sedaris. Arya Talok, of all people, got him to do it. Crazy. You can say that again. Yep. Thanks for your help, Shepard. Anytime, Bailey. Anytime. You need anything from me, you just let me know. Please, for one moment, please. I'm gonna stop by Purgatory. We'll chat with Arya for a bit. Let her know how we feel about all this. Can't do anything with the Blue Suns till we f scan a system and find the artifact. It, it, you don't need to bring a continual supply either. You need to get like one and give it to him. And then just pretend from there on out that you're giving him high end stuff. I hate being stuck here. I hate this guard duty assignment. I hate everything right now. I hate everything. Nothing to do about it. We each stand duty in our own ways. At least your wife and the kids went on that trip you mentioned a while back. Where was it again? They canceled the trip. Donated the funds to some charity when Earth was hit. And then, how? Shit. I'm sorry. Like, does he even know if they're safe? You know, it's like, it's like, ah. Haven't been to Benning yet. That's a pretty big mission, though. Bastards had us. Assholes. Shit, they just kept coming and coming. And not even sure from where. Fucking hell. And poor Bilal. They didn't have to take him out like that. Brutal. 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 All that guy has to do is come down here and listen to them talk. Do you guys have a tab? Where are the dancers? <laughs> dancers. Well, the dance board. He's like, he like pointed dancers. over there. Dancers. I'm here for shore leave, not the Viennese waltz. I, I don't, um... Oh, come on. If there's an ass shaking somewhere on this station, you guys know where it is. He's like, I, I don't know how to handle this. What happened to your subordinates from before? These are different. Well, that guy might be the same. I don't know. Did the Batarian betray you? Look who's here. So what's on your mind, Shepard? Are the blood pack falling in line? With Grill in charge, where all systems go. It's his voice, but my words. Couldn't have asked for a better puppet. The blood pack have committed 2,000 Vorcha to the cause. They'll make up the bulk of the army. Well, where's freaking the freaking Krogan? The Krogan started the blood pack. What have we gained by having the Eclipse at our disposal? A ton of mechs and elite troopers for stealth operations. Sane has turned out to be more mouth exactly. than Sedaris ever was. My control of the Eclipse runs even deeper than I expected. You surprised me by taking such agency in the matter. <laughs> no, I think with Jonah Sedaris, it probably Jonah would have been headbutting with Arya the whole time, you know? This makes it so that she has full control over all aspects of the Blood Pack, Blue Suns, and Eclipse. Blood pack, Omega. Wait. Did we already. What's new with you? That's supposed to be funny? Ah! Let's see. I've lost Omega. I got C sec eyes all over me, and I'm holed up in this poor excuse for a nightclub. Can't even get Novarian rum here. In other words, I'm in hell. How do you plan on taking Omega back? I think I'm going to employ violence. <laughs> I'm gonna slap Omega. I'm very right looking forward to getting the Omega DLC. Little hands. We'll talk later. I'm sure. 
It's an interesting relationship Shepard has with Arya. Oh, you guys, you guys do something eventually. That gives me a quest. Yo, James. I'm just gonna hang here for a while. All right, don't break your neck or anything. Uh, I don't think there's any point in stuff. Oh, oh, the dancer is talking to the to the Turian guard. Mm, oh, oh, you can you can drink. Yeah, no big deal. Don't got time for drinking. Uh, and now we need to go see Cortez. Oh man. Let's see, what could we what can we do with this? Oh yeah, that's right. I was like, there's no point in that if it's right next to the elevator, but that's that's the point of it. Welcome I forgot. To Commander Shepherd. Please select a uh, What are we doing? What are we doing? We are Going to see Cortez. Moment, Gonna go take a breather after doing all this dirty work for everybody else. Gonna go chill with my new pal Cortez. Now arriving at I guess I was saying you don't get a Solarian or a Krogan companion, but I guess you get a Protheum one, so that's pretty cool. I'm sorry, honey. I didn't want you to worry. Chances are, I'll never even need to put on armor. I know, and I'm sorry. That's what you get for marrying a civilian. Are you and the girls going to be okay? Combat pay isn't as much as I make at the dig site. We'll be fine. The last thing I want you to worry about is paying the bills. Just don't go too crazy with new dance classes, okay? I was in the drop, though. I can't get the girls there on time, and I was probably gonna go pick up an extra shift at work. Oh. Well, we'll make it up to the girls when I get back. Dance classes, biotic gymnastics, whatever they want. Yeah. I don't think it's a good idea to drop that kind of stuff, but what are you gonna do, you know? Like, you gotta give the girls something to focus on besides the fact that their dad's gone, but what's the mom gonna do, you know? You finally made it off the Normandy. Glad I did. Even with the chaos of all the refugees, seeing so many ships in flight is comforting. All he did was like, gets me thinking. walk off the Normandy a little bit, but hey, it's something. Hey, a Turian frigate. I think that's the PFS Havenkov. What's one Turian warship doing at the Citadel? Looking for dry dock, I bet. She's seen battle. Look at the waiver in her drive core emissions. Alone, limping, looking for a haven. Maybe it would have been better to just go down fighting, like their families back home. Are you talking about the Turians or yourself? I should have been there. With Robert. But you weren't. You're alive. And that's a good thing. Maybe so. The lives of future generations rest on those Turian shoulders. On our shoulders. Nobody's given up. Not those Turians. Not me, not you. If anyone can pull this all together, it's you. Is that an Alliance cruiser? What's it doing here? That's the SSV London. Decommissioned years ago. Look, no guns. Refugees must have salvaged her from a shipyard. Geneva-class cruisers always had ESO cores like granite. People find a way to survive. Do whatever it takes to see another day. <sighs> Gotta let go. For real this time. The refugees here put up a memorial wall. They leave mementos of lost loved there ones. There we go. So I was thinking maybe. What's stopping you? Nothing. I mean, let me think about it. Hey man, you do whatever you need to. Your suggestion to come out here was a good one, Commander. I needed this. Your suggestion to come out here was a good one, Commander. You need to kind of get out of your little box that you're in, you know? The ship can be a box. It's good to get out, even if it's like, you know, still recycled air. At least it's, you know, it's different recycled air. 
I always hate kind of interrupting him, though. It's, it's a Paragon action, but I still hate interrupting him. It's like, uh, I know you were saying something important, but I'm just gonna interrupt you. Hey, -oh. Let's see, do we have anything? Counselor Adina, Fane, Arya, James, Liara. All right, looks like they're good. Um, I think I'll call this one here. Um, thank you guys for joining me. I know we're st it still kind of feels like we're getting into the game. I'm still, I'm like, hey, like I want to go and like, you know, do action-y fun things, but at the same time, you need to take the time. Like part of the, half the fun of a Bioware game is interacting with your friends and your companions and the various people in the world, so. I don't know, it's a little bit of a mix. Still getting into it, I think, but I'm, I'm still learning the Infiltrator, too, but hopefully I'm picking up a little bit more on that. But uh, thank you guys again for joining me. I hope you're enjoying it. I will see you in the next one.